Hello, I'm Dr. Butler, and I'm excited to introduce you guys to today's film, Balloon. This film takes a really gripping look at an escape attempt from East Germany. As a sociologist, this film uh, does more than just excite. It introduces lots of concepts around propaganda and ideology that are exemplified by the material items all throughout the scenes. What you can see are uh, architecture, you can see cars, you can see buildings that have phone booths in them. I'm not sure that you guys remember those, but these small details are very consequential. It had huge consequences for people's everyday lives. The ways that they thought about things were changed by these everyday objects. So while you're watching, while you're excited about all of these thrilling challenges that are being overcome by the protagonist, think about the lives of these everyday people attempting to flee East Germany. Think about how the GDR was a system that was in place based on ideas and how these ideas were circulated throughout society through different material items that you're gonna see throughout the film. Think about how the language that they speak in has enormous impact on the ideas that are shared among people. Now, Bentham and Foucault give us the concept of the panopticon where we are surveilled State surveillance was common in East Germany and the GDR. And so you're going to see how that system of surveillance got people to surveil themselves, the psychological self-surveillance known as the panopticon. This film provides hope. As they say, it's better than camping. We're going to the West. But no matter what happens, don't let go.